Brittany? No freaking way. <laughs> Hello. Hi, it's Teresa. How are you? I'm okay. How are you? I'm, I'm doing well. It's okay if I work with you live? Yeah. Okay. So, Brittany, I do have the gentleman coming to my awareness. He makes me feel like husband, brother, friend, contemporary to you. It's like your age, your generation. Did that resonate so far? Yeah. Okay. He also makes me feel like a fall or like from a height or falling. Does that resonate? Um, yes. Okay. Yes, he felt. Okay. And then also there's um, August or the 8th of any month. Birthday anniversary or passing is important. Yeah, my birthday is August. Well, that would be important then, right? Because you're important. Yeah. That's, that's how he makes me feel. Yeah. Okay. And then also, we have the PR name because you're Brittany. <laughs> yeah. Now, <clears throat> he's also making reference to two kids or one of two. There's two. Um, We don't have any kids, but we do have like nephews and nieces. Well, okay. Specifically the boys. Where's the two boys? Uh, he has two nephews. Two nephews. Okay, so you understand. Specifically that. on his side. Okay, because he's saying um, the, the two boys, the two boys. Okay, so this would this would be your husband then. Yes. Your your husband. Okay, and he's showing me so where you're at, or where you're sitting, or where you're where you're at. To the uh -huh. right of you, there's an angel connection or an angel reference or wings, there's angel connection. What's that angel connection to where you're sitting to the right? Um, he's, I, I don't know his flannels right beside me. Um, I feel like there's an angel or angel wings like in front of you to the right. Now you're gonna be walking around your house. You're like, where is this? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm sitting. Uh, is, are we for sure it's me? Like, how do we know? What do you mean? Do you, I mean, you feel like it's me? Yes, I do. So where you're sitting to the, like in front of you, it could be in the next room over, but it's in front of you to the right. There's an angel or angel rings. There's a, that connection. Okay. I'm going to write it down. Okay. You write it down. I see it later. Okay. Cause he makes you feel like where you sit oh oh my gosh maybe he's talking about my notebook i made for him in front of me i i made my own notebook and he's on the bed with angel wings okay thank you oh is it right in front of me. is it in front of you yeah okay is it in front of you did, did you have to go like to the right to get it <laughs> yeah okay as long as you understand because he makes you feel like right in front of you angel wings so you made this for him uh well for me to write in for you to write in yeah, but it's got his pictures on it and the back of it. So no, it has this, him with wings. Brittany, this is so important for you to know. He's with you. He sees you. He knows what's going on. So he he's hearing your he, he's hearing your messages. He's getting your messages. Okay. So it's important. So know that when you're doing that, he's right there. Okay. Now okay. he, he's also showing me like I feel like he has a sense of humor. <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> Funniest guy I know. Gosh darn it. I don't know if he's being serious or if he's 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 pulling my leg here. Um he, he looks serious in everything he does, but he's very funny. Okay. I think what he's showing me is a microphone, like um Somebody from rehab told me that he was going to propose to me in December over karaoke. Oh, I was going to say karaoke. Uh, oh. So you understand the microphone? I think so. I think that's what that's Absolutely for. Absolutely is because I was going to say karaoke. That we weren't married yet. And you know, I don't, I don't get it like that. I, I, I just get that love connection and it feels like a husband. Yeah, you called him your husband, even if the thing says my husband. Mm -hmm. And he says you have the ring, or you know the ring. What's that connection? I mean, I I have the promise ring he okay. gave me our first Christmas. So you do have the ring, because he's saying you have the ring. You know the ring. You have the ring. Yeah. 
I have the the first one. He kept trying to get me to get a second one that was cheap so that we could just be married really quick. But I kept telling him that I deserved better. And so I wanted, you know, I didn't want one of those plastic Amazon things. <laughs> okay. And he's also, he's, he also makes me feel for you not to, to hold on to that shame or that guilt. I wish I would have, you know, did something better or different. Does that resonate with you? Yeah. So in other words, he doesn't want you to hold, I know it's easier said than done, but he, he makes you feel like not, not holding on to that, that, that shame or guilt. And he says, go ahead and get that car. What is that connection? Get the car. Get the vehicle. There's a new vehicle. Well, he has a motorcycle, but I can't get, I don't have any right. He has, he has, he has two babies in this world and one's a motorcycle and one's his dog named after his motorcycle. <laughs> No, are you are you talking about or thinking about getting the vehicle? Um, in in May, my lease is up, and I have to decide on something new. Because he's saying, so I don't know if you're having that conversation or if you're in a conversation. Because he's saying, get go ahead and get the vehicle. So, do you understand that connection? Mm. No, but I'll write it down if there's something that comes to mind. <sighs> nah, I feel like it's. I feel like it's more current. You write that down again. Know how he's coming through and how he could be anchoring to family. I feel like it's more current. Okay. I mean, it could be his vehicle, but his vehicle's in a shop. But I don't have rights to it. So I don't really, I don't know. I don't understand that. And you may not understand it until later. Again, he could be highlighting his family too as well. Okay. Okay. And okay. Then there's another brother or there's a brother connection. Uh, yeah, he has he has several brothers. Um, okay, because he's he's making reference to the brother. And there's that. Go ahead. Deceased or here? Well, he. he I, I'm not getting that. He's just making. I'll, I'll get you there. He's making reference to the brother. Mm -hmm. And there's also like a police connection or police officer. <laughs> yeah, I was trying. I was trying to get his ashes, and we were at a celebration of life. And I asked his mom if I could have the ashes. Uh, a couple times and she said yes so when i went to go get them some of them uh his mother sent his brothers down to take the ashes from me so it was really traumatic and everybody was screaming at me that they were going to call the cops on us if we didn't leave oh. and i was just trying to get some ashes okay so know how he's coming through he's very well aware of what's going on and that and that's what caused the, the, the rift in the family well, yeah, because I told of, everybody, one of, one of I was like, Sean would punch all of you guys in the face right now. You're direct family members. He would not let you guys treat me like this. Okay. How, how terrible. And I'm so sorry you had to go through that. So, again, know how he's coming through because he's making connection to the brother and he's saying the police and you understand all of that. So, know that he knows, yeah. he knows what's going on. And this isn't about judging or pointing fingers or, <clears throat> or making somebody a bad person, but people do not nice things and that's just us being human and it's not nice but he's coming through for you out of his love for you and he supports you he guides you and he loves you and you there's also the connection i know you mentioned the dog you wanted to keep the dog and then they took the dog there's something with the dog yeah that's his pride and joy baby uh is dinah and his mom won't let me have her, but she, his mom doesn't really take his. There's some drug issues in the family, so I just want to protect her. And I feel like Sean would tell me not to worry about the bike and not to worry about the ashes, but to get his dog. And I tried to call a lawyer today to see what I could do, but I'm not married to him. So I look very small on a totem pole of anything. Right. Uh, which, which makes it so difficult. Okay. But yes, his dog was his everything. <laughs> okay. His dog was with him when he was when he was passing. Okay. He also makes me feel um not to hold that shame or that guilt. There, there's if your hands are tied, there's nothing you could do. There's nothing you could do. And it doesn't it doesn't change how he feels for you and how he's gonna still support you and guide you. Okay. Okay. Sorry, all this is still really fresh. And 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 the, and and that's okay. This is why we're here. This is exactly why we're here. Okay. And there's an uh -huh. is there an amber? Where's the A? I'm seeing the A initial. Oh, probably my sister Ashley has been with me a lot through this. Okay, that's fine. That's the she, A, a she connection. Me, Sean, when we okay. were kids. 
and he's showing me a monkey. <laughs> um, it's probably me. Um, my email's Brit Monkey, and so I don't know. I don't know all my stuff's Brit Monkey. <laughs> oh my gosh, beautiful, beautiful. Again, just backing up what I'm just saying because he's saying monkey. So if it's Brit Monkey, then he's going to bring that up. So, is there any questions that you have? Um, like I'm sure you're going to say he's like fully at peace. He so great question. This is one of the number one questions I get asked. All of your loved ones. Yes, he's good. You're not. You're not. He's good. You're not. Okay. And totally random and quirky again. He's talking about changing bed sheets. Did you just change like the comforter or the sheets? Um, I haven't. Um, no. Oh, gosh. Hmm. Or saving bed sheets. There's there's a bed or the comforter. There's that there's that connection. Um I'm not sure. I'll leave it there with you. Okay. Um can you tell if he's with his friend TJ? Like is that something he would be like, Oh yeah, I am. <laughs> yes. So your- again, another great question. All the, all all the loved one all your loved ones like and, and his they're all together on like they're good they're together they've met up they've done their thing you're not you miss them here physically and there's no separation and no divide even when we make our transition they're still here very much with us and present just vibrating at a high rate which is pure love do you know if he wants me to try to get the dog like should I try really hard harder than when I'm I'm not trying to start war. That's what I pray about all the you time. Know what? He makes me feel like let the, feel like he, he, makes me, he makes me feel like let the dust settle. So in other okay, words, that's let, what my let, sister let, said today. Let let the dust settle. Let, let some things settle because they're high emotions, and there's something there's a connection to bed sheets or a comforter. And I'll just leave it there. You 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 um <laughs> you write it down, okay? I did. Okay, all right, my friend. I I leave his love with you, okay? Thank you so much. This you're, was very cool. You're, very you're, cool experience. You're, I appreciate you're, it. You're very welcome. And um, we're all sending you love and holding space for you. Okay. Okay. All right. Thank friend. you. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. Bye. Oh boy, guys, let's send her lots of plus love, please.